is how I play the game! That is an epic fucking intro, dude. And I have to warn everyone, warning, what you may see right now is going to be absolutely disgusting. Uh, I saw a sharp decline in YouTube views. Views, views, views. I don't want to be Mr. Views. Wah, I'm not making ad revenue. Wah. In the last day where, you know, it was captured by YouTube analytics, it's what they called it. The, the thing that they use to daily track performance on YouTube, all right? It dipped really big. And because of this big dip, that's it. You know, I can't I can't continue to continuously play the same game if it's not going to bring people to stream and no one's going to watch on YouTube. I just can't, all right? So that being said, um, that being said, guys, uh, I am going to uh, mix it up this week. Double dip. Today will be the last hurrah. Today I am going to do God of War here on my main gameplay stream. Oh, oh my God, excuse me. Uh, ooh, excuse me. On Friday, it's the return of Bloodborne. Uh, excuse me. Shout out! <laughs> uh, Heng Zhu Heng cheered again and said, Sorry, well, actually, he didn't cheer again. Well, actually, did, did he cheer earlier? Oh, no, he subbed. Okay, thank you, Heng Zhu Heng. So he cheered and said, My English is not that good, but for clarification, a couple of months back, you said you never had a business. You referred to it as an entity. I'm not a business. You know, this is a business. This is the way that I put food on my table and I pay my bills and I pay my taxes. And if I don't make money, I can't keep doing it. Now you keep saying my business. Is it a business or not? Very confusing. Um, well, Hang Zhu Hang, you probably <clears throat> were not around for the saga that I went through late last year. All right. In a, in a nutshell, here's the saga. I, when I moved across the country from Connecticut to Washington State in 2014, was supposed to register as a business... And I was supposed to begin paying Washington State business and occupation taxes. The laws here dictate that I should have done so. However, I had an accountant from Connecticut, uh, and he was also my tax attorney, both my accountant and my tax attorney, okay, who claimed he knew all the laws of Washington and he could do all my taxes properly when he didn't. And he didn't do due diligence, he didn't research this, and he didn't find out that I was supposed to register as a business and that I was supposed to pay taxes. So I now have uh, two and a half years of unpaid taxes. Okay, where's the evidence? Present evidence of what you're saying. There's no way you could just lie, 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 and never have a fact behind it and expect this story to hold. And it's his fault, because he's fucked me over, basically. Um, <clears throat> so, when I say, oh, my business, yes, as of now, you know, this is a business. I have a legally registered business, uh, and I pay taxes on it. You know, and apparently I was supposed to. When I lived in the state of Connecticut, that was not the case because Connecticut actually has state income tax. So in Connecticut, they do not legally require you to register as a business. As long as you pay income tax, you're okay. Here in the state of Washington, there is no income tax, personal income tax for the state. So they require you to register as a business and pay taxes that way. Although I'll tell you, the taxes for the, the business tax here in the state, way, way lower. Do you want to play the fucking game? Than they are as a personal income tax in Connecticut. All right. So there you go. I mean, it's, it's way more beneficial to be here than in Connecticut. If I went back to Connecticut, I'd be paying, like, way more tax than I am here, okay? But that being said, uh, yeah, not, you know... I, I never used to be a business. Now I am. And this is not an April Fool's joke or anything like that. I was required by law to register as a business. And by the way, yes, this is the case. Anyone who is a YouTuber, anyone who is a streamer, anyone who brings in income via, you know, the internet like I do, legally is required if they make a certain amount of money a year to register as a business in the state of Washington. A lot of people seem to be blown away by this information. They're like, huh? Yeah, it's true. It's just that no one apparently is paying attention to this and no one's doing their taxes properly. So I think the state of Washington is due a lot of money if they ever get wind of this and start basically researching people who are YouTubers slash streamers who live in Washington state and are not registered properly. Uh, yeah, there's going to be a lot of back taxes due. <clears throat> so there you go. Uh, but yeah, I am, uh, you know, now everything has been required to be done under the guise of being a business, okay? Wow.
All right, Heng Zhu Heng again cheered and said, I just subbed and cheered and immediately I got PMs calling me a zipper head and China man, which I don't understand. Why did I someone support you? Went, oh, it's a troll. It's a troll. <laughs> it's a troll. <laughs> he was a troll to begin with. Aw, oh, man. You know, sometimes... I'm glad I didn't read the rest of that message, but sometimes you just get fooled. What can I say? He almost got me. But in reality, in reality, who actually didn't, you know, did, got out of here because you just paid me? <laughs> you just paid me. So there you go. You paid me to troll, stupid. Why am I toxic? Thank you. Really, thank you. All right. So, anyway, let's get rid of this guy. <sighs> Goodbye to the troll. By the way, I just had to uh, reorder. Uh, well, not reorder, but I had to order a new external hard drive. Because remember yesterday I told you guys mine died? So I just dropped about $110 on Amazon to get a new external hard drive. More money I don't have, so I went right on a nice credit card. Unbelievable. Man, I'm stupid. Majin Buu, no, I don't have zero dollars in my bank account, but all of my money is already accounted for. What? What? I'm in so much debt that it, whatever money comes in goes right out to bills. A silver-tongued talker, right? Oh, I'm just going to say it one way, and hopefully you'll believe it, even though that's not the truth. And that's literally what's happening here. The guy's a liar. The guy's a fucking blatant liar. And lying to everyone. But people are believing it because they don't know any better. Or is being saved to pay taxes. So literally there's no disposable income. That's the problem. Black Mage C-Type, yes the Seagate drive has a warranty. The problem is they don't give you your money back. They just give you a replacement drive that I don't want. There's no way I'm using another Seagate drive that's probably just going to fail again anyway. So the warranty is literally useless. There's no reason for me to get the replacement because I'm just going to fucking not use it. So, So there you go. In reality, warranties for most electronics are pretty useless because they're only required by law to give you the equivalent product or refurbished model of the same thing. And if your original one broke, why the fuck do you want another one that's just going to fail anyway, right? So there you go. <clears throat> Bill's a scammer. Burn in hell, Burnell. And now I'm going to burn in hell for the rest of eternity because of it. You can't change who you are, I guess. Save the pig! <laughs> What the heck? A pig with a party hat. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Piggy. Ziggy Piggy. Save the pig, the game. The whole game you're trying to save the pig's life. Help! What pasta do you prefer? I prefer a penne. Oh! Easy to eat. Phil's a faggot, Phil's fat, Phil's a loser, Phil's a beggar, Phil's a racist, Phil's a scammer. DSP is a pedophile, DSP is a thief, DSP is a greedy fuck. This on? guy's a bitch. I have a micro penis. <laughs> Alright, I'm not dead, but I swear to god I wish I fucking was.